The painful arc test is used to determine if a patient's shoulder pain is due to subacromial impingement of the rotator cuff tendons, particularly the supraspinatus or the subacromial bursa. Start by having the patient abduct their arm slowly. The initial 60 degrees of movement should not reproduce their pain, as no structures are impinged under the acromion. Beyond 60 degrees, the patient should report pain occurring at the lateral side of the shoulder around the tip of the acromion process. It's important to confirm that this is the same pain that they've been experiencing prior to coming into the clinic. As the patient continues to abduct their arm past 120 degrees, the patient should report that the pain dissipates. Now have the patient lower their arm in the same controlled fashion, and again the pain should reproduce between 120 and 60 degrees of abduction and the patient may have difficulty controlling the descent of their arm. These findings yield a positive painful arc test, which in combination with other history and physical exam, can be used to inform a diagnosis of subacromial impingement syndrome or rotator cuff pathology.